For 461 days, there's been no roaring applause, only a hollow hall with seats unfilled. Silence. There's very few things in the world that can match the applause of 2,000 people when this orchestra is playing, and that losing that has been the hardest part. But on Friday, a homecoming for the Minnesota Orchestra, welcoming a live audience for the first time since it was forced to shutter last spring. Being able to get that back is just, it feels like just another step towards the world coming back towards whatever normal <laughs> is going to be like. Concert goers elated to truly experience the moment not behind a screen. Well, it's a big deal. I mean, I think people start feeling normal again. It feels wonderful. Yeah, it really does. The orchestra has and still does offer virtual performances online, but it's not the same as hearing the melodies start to play when you're there in the seats. For the musicians, it marks a significant milestone, not only as professionals, but as people who have weathered the pandemic like everyone else. My extrovert and human-loving side is malnourished, though, and I'm very excited to get back to performing and seeing people because that is what we want to do is share our music and share why we love this music. There are still some COVID era provisions here, like 25% capacity for the month of June and July and August, 50% capacity. But come September, Orchestra Hall hopes it will be a packed house for showtime. Caroline Cummings, WCCO 4 News.